Hello guys, in this video we will read a message from service bus queue and then we will map or convert it into our custom C sharp object using deserialization. So we are in Azure portal, we have opened this queue that is our first queue and you see there is one message in this queue and if I open that message, you see the message contains are first name Harshal, last name Jain and salary 25,000. So that is a JSON string and now we will convert it into this employee object so that the properties from that message that is first name last name and salary those will match to the fields from this employee class okay and now let's do that before that let's quickly see what code we have written so first of all we have installed this NuGet package that is azure.messaging.servicebus then we have this connection string to connect to that queue then queue name from which we will read that message then we created service bus client using that connection string and we created service bus receiver from that service bus client and from that queue name okay and then here on line number 17 we are reading that message and then on line number 18 we are converting that message to a string that is a json string and now we will convert that json string into an instance of class employee so i will say employee employee 1 is equal to json convert so we will use this nuget package that is json convert and json convert is available because we have installed this newtonsoft.json okay so i will say json convert dot uh, deserialize object into type employee and we will pass this message body in json to that okay and finally simply add a debugger on this line number 25 and let's run our program so our debugger has been hit let's quickly go back to the visual studio and if i take my mouse to this employee one object you see we have these three properties and values in these three properties and this data has been actually retrieved from service bus queue okay so that's it guys thanks thanks for listening